I'm Tim Brown, I'm with Immersat, I'm the Director of Cloud and Infrastructure. We are the mobile satellite companies, we have about 2,000 employees around the globe, but we have 45 different offices, five different data centers, we operate on every continent, and we service markets truly around the globe. We started out 40 years ago as a uh, maritime safety service, providing you know guaranteed service 24/7 out to maritime, out to governments on land and at sea. We've evolved over the years. We now provide high-speed broadband out to everything from planes to cruise ships to on land, on sea to governments. One of the decisions we made early on is that we wanted to work with an organization that could support us through the journey. AWS is innovating so quickly, and to be able to adopt, manage, and maintain a lot of the innovation you have to become an expert. From our strategy, we started out with a, what we called a proof of concept release one project. So we really wanted to, to start out, get a stake in the ground, understand, get some lessons learned. And our first primary goal of release one, which we completed in February of 2019, was to move 10% of our workloads. As we started to build out our business case for release two, we decided on the number to be in release two is gonna be another 55%. So some total of 65% of our workloads, which we're gonna to try to finish again by the end of February, 2020 and uh, we're currently on target to actually exceed that. So by going through the rapid acceleration program, we worked through a, a huge workshop. And through that workshop, we brought in some partners like Junction and CenturyLink. And as we walked through those programs, it was a forced time period where we had all the stakeholders in the room. We rapidly got on the same page and they asked us 74 questions. And it was kind of like therapy. They were brutally honest questions about where we were from a security point of view, where we were from a human point of view, a skills point of view, a center of excellence point of view. And at the end of that, they gave us really honest answers. It wasn't anything that shocked or that uh, told us something we didn't know, but what it was was a, a great document in a great way that we all communicated together, agreed to that, and agreed to a way forward. So I think that helped us greatly. Amazon really understands the longer term goals here and the commitment and the relationship is just as critical as the kind of the short term. We're good with the fact that Amazon Web Services follows a model that supports innovation. So a lot of times new tool sets will come out. They may not have all the features you want, but they continually move the bar forward. So it's important to us that we see constant innovation and a lot of times the challenges that we're facing today are getting solved at a rapid pace.